Hey there. It didn't just find me, honestly. It was with me the whole time. It was in the pages of my diary. Writing really did save my life. There are many people that ask the same question. How does one find their niche? Well, it's really very simple. You do not find your niche. You take steps towards something that caught you off guard. At first, you didn't realize it catches you off guard because it appears shiny and brand new. As you get close to it, you start to feel strange, almost like you don't wanna get away from it, but you can't seem to understand why it's pulling you closer and closer. This is a note to myself in hopes that it encourages someone else. As you take steps towards your daily life, you do things without realizing that actually gets you closer to discovering your niche. I am currently enrolled in a artificial intelligence machine learning class and it's pretty hard. It's not easy. I truly do not understand what I will use this knowledge for. For some strange reason, learning it is so exciting to me. And so as I continue to write in my journal, I, it came to me just like that, that I genuinely love to learn. My niche is learning new things. You can say I'm a polymath, right? I mean, I'm not gonna say that I'm not. Learning for some strange reason gets me excited because it's a part of growing. It's a part of developing skills that I have yet to discover within myself. My niche really is learning new things. It's not the shiny new objects that get me excited, but learning of a new world that didn't exist to me just yet is what really gets me motivated to keep going. To know that there is more to life than what's in front of me, to know that there is more to life than what other people are telling me, it just gets me even more excited to continue to learn, no matter what it takes, no matter how much patience it requires, no matter how much time and energy I need to invest, that my niche is learning new things. It's a part of who I am. I love to learn. I have recently dived into the world of animation. It's very difficult, it is not easy, but it's something that I cannot pull away from, no matter how hard I try. What's the point of this video? The point of this video is to encourage you to live life strategically and write, right? <laughs> right, right? <laughs> I say that because starting off writing in a diary as a young child, was something that I didn't think would help me to put words to my feelings or put words to my thoughts and getting them out of my head. As time progressed and as I've gotten older, for some strange reason, I also like the idea of anything visual, right? Visual arts, music videos, later on turning into filmmaking. I developed a love for filmmaking, which is why I'm learning animation. I wanna be able to create these things that I keep seeing in my head when I hear certain songs. So writing really started all of this. Writing helps you to put words to thoughts that you continue to have, but you have not put on paper. Do you know how freeing it feels to take the words out of your head and write them down and then read them back to yourself? Write out your everyday thoughts, whether they are big or small. It plays a unique role in developing a formal way to articulate your niche. Simple formula that you can jot down on a sticky note. Niche equals writing, parentheses, three, plus reading, parentheses, six. I'm gonna continue on explaining that formula in another video. Overall, I hope this video is just encouraging you to write. I mean, it's really very simple, yet it is difficult. Not everyone has the patience to sit still, take their hand, grab a writing utensil, and put it to paper, and let your brain be free. It's hard. Imposter syndrome can kick in on overdrive and tell you you have to write a certain way, a certain format has to be laid out on this piece of paper before you can really articulate your thought. Welcome to the Nellie Drayton Show, where creatives gather to go beyond and kind of sort of figure it out. It's what we do here. And I hope that this video encourages you and inspires you to get a piece of paper and some form of writing utensil and write your heart out.